Hello and welcome, people of the internet. Today, I found this awesome trail, and I'm taking you along for the ride. It leads to this really awesome farmer's uh, field. It's gated, though, so I couldn't get in. Uh, but, you know, it's all in good fun, right? Today's an awesome day. Everyone else is freezing, and in Florida, it is an awesome 80-something degrees. I can actually wear my summer armor now and just be cool with it. Haha, <laughs> get it, puns, be cool. Anyways, today, uh, I'm going to be talking about, everyone has this, it's a bucket list, and uh, puddle. One of the first things uh, I'd like to talk about on my list anyway is a pretty generic one. Everyone wants to like dive with sharks or feed sharks. I personally, myself, as me, I mean like me, I want to actually write my name. Write my name on the side of one of these guys. And, uh, yeah, if you saw that correctly, that's a shark. Instead of just feeding sharks, I would actually like to write my name on one. I don't know if that's animal cruelty or whatever. Maybe I'll have to use some kind of marker that comes off um, in, like, two seconds or something. But someone will have to take a picture of that. Um, yeah, so I'll just one up all of them. I'll actually write my name. Or, heck, there are people out there that ride sharks. If I could do that, I would do it. You know, without losing any limbs. Um, but yeah, everyone out there has a bucket list. Uh, right now, that's just me checking out a cool campsite. Let's leave that behind. Uh, you know, you guys can share with me what you got. I always love new ideas. Um, pretty much... A lot of my bucket list is like ridiculous eight-year-old stuff that can never happen. Like, I want the War Machine Iron Man suit. Uh, not gonna happen. Not in my lifetime, anyway. I don't think exoskeletons like that are gonna exist. Uh, and anyway, this trail just empties into this little cul-de-sac area by some warehouses, and honestly, I love this place. I can't believe I didn't discover it sooner. The next thing uh, on my list is gonna be this awesome thing. Everyone does it as well. It's gonna be skydiving. But I also want to take one of those um, skydiving weird perspective photos. And I'll just show one real quick. I hope you guys saw that. That's the uh, skydiving dude. Um, in that kind of silhouetted sunset thing. That's what I would like my photo to be. Uh, maybe in a different position or something. Like, I want it to look like I'm running on top of a cloud or something like that. And, um, actually, I have yet to do this in my life yet. I would actually like to learn a martial art. I know tons of people know them already. Like, people do boxing and things like that. But I would actually like to learn some. Uh, in particular, I would like to learn uh, Muay Thai kickboxing. Or I'd like to do, um... Some kind of mixed martial arts, I guess. I don't know if that's my style, though. I don't know if I'd like it, but I'm willing to give it a shot as much as the next guy. I'll probably just come back home with, like, tons of bruises and stuff. And, um, pretty much that's my list. And, uh, the reasonable part of my list, anyway. Um, I have really normal stuff on my list. Like, I'd like to buy my own place. Um, I got my own vehicle. Check the KLR650. Awesome vehicle for a first time. Uh, oh, well, I guess technically that's not my first vehicle, because I had a KLR 250 beforehand, but whatever. KLR is my main vehicle, paid for it myself and everything, it's good. Oh, darn, darn traffic lights, and there's a cop over there. Urgh. It's really funny, because uh, I didn't even notice the cop until I saw this video. Like, I had no idea there was a cop there before. I just thought it was a guy driving a black car. Um, in front of me, you can see a Nissan Leaf. Um... For those of you guys out there who actually have one, let me know how that is. I'm kind of 50-50 about electric cars and things like that. I don't know if I'll like them or hate them. Uh, coming up is some boxing. That's pretty much what I'd like to try. Uh, Muay Thai kickboxing. Um, if you guys have seen the show Idiot Abroad, the European guy goes off to this um, place in Thailand to try um, blind kickboxing. Where it's like kung fu kickboxing where they blindfold you with a bandana. And it is the funniest thing ever. Because the first images they show us is like the two guys beating up the referee. Because they think it's an enemy or whatever. 
And then the European guy goes in with, like, one day of trading. And it's really funny. He actually lasts on his own, but, like, half the time he was beating up, like, a post. <laughs> he must have been, like, standing there for, like, a good, you know, 20 seconds. Like, wow, this guy's really tough. He won't move or budge or anything. Uh, yeah. So, pretty much, that's my bucket list. I will leave you with that. And, uh, do I know how to say goodbye in another language? I do not. So, I'll just say, see you guys later in English. And, uh, until my next video, subscribe and keep on riding, guys.